bit closer together. Okay. Hello. All right, cool. Hi. <laughs> Brad Oltmans and Rick Rosas yes. of Price Waterhouse. Thank you for your time. Your pleasure. Gentlemen, people always ask me, how does Price Waterhouse go about calculating and counting the ballots? Uh, sure. Sure. The uh, Price Waterhouse Coopers mails out the Oscar ballots directly to the voting members of the Academy. Uh, they're returned in the mail directly to us and we then go through basically a three-day process of counting by hand each and every ballot in all 24 categories. We have a small team of PwC professionals who help us, and at the end of the count, Rick and I are the only two people who actually know the results for each of the 24 categories. How long have you two been doing this, Rick? This is my 10th year doing overseeing the Oscar balloting, and this is Brad's seventh. Seventh year. And so, when you find out, do you even tell your Wives or significant others or friends? No, or? no, no, no one, at all. No Dude, one no knows one. until they're announced on stage. Yeah. And how is it that Price Waterhouse, with all the competition out there, has been able to maintain this long standing relationship with the Oscar? And they have something to be talked yeah. about. The Academy is one of PwC's longest standing clients. We've been doing this work uh, for the Academy virtually since the beginning. So this is our 77th year. Congratulations. Very valued client and business relationship for us, and uh, I know they appreciate the work we do for them as well. Mr. Ross, you want to add something to that? No, we're just very proud of the 77 year history of being associated with the Academy Awards. It is one of our most uh, cherished uh, client relationships we have, and we're very proud of how long it's been endured. Yeah, you want to ask a question? Yeah, I mean, I'm, this is a woman's question since this is the Super Bowl of fashion. What are you going to be wearing? <laughs> <laughs> pretty standard black tux, white shirt, black tie. Look pretty much the same as everybody else. <laughs> Help, it helps to be a guy in this case. It's, yeah. it's easy to dress us. Great. So it also inures you from the criticism, the uh, po pr post game. Uh, That's true. Uh, no bold colors, <laughs> no pastel yeah. colors. Okay. Has there ever been a, a controversy around voting or counting with? The kind of uh, processes like we, we some people call it preference voting. Are there people who don't understand that and they and they say, "Hey, explain this." Sure, and, you know, yeah. Because we had that problem in Oakland with preference voting. The, preference yeah, the, 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 the preferential voting uh, system, which is used for the nominations, it is fairly complex from a mathematical standpoint, and so from time to time we do give people explanations of it, but the, the real premise of it is to give each and every voter a chance to influence the outcome. I have another question. Oh, sorry, I think you wanted to ask something. I, I was just going to add that, you know, the case of the Academy itself, though, they've been using this process for well over 50, 60 years, so the membership themselves understands it very well, and they know how to fill up the ballots. And I ask because there, there were jumps in when it was used, you know, there were there were gaps. It was used, I think, in, the, I think in 1948, they stopped using it and then started. Um, just from memory, I could yeah, get it wrong, but yeah, that that's why I asked the question. Yeah. For, for yeah. decades, Marla, for the Marla? nominations. Were there any other potential challenges now that you had 10 pictures? I mean, was there, was there was it more complicated? Uh, did people not know to vote for 10? I mean, well, was there it, anything that happened? Yeah. The, um, the instructions that the Academy gave the voting members for the best picture nominations, it has a lot of similarity to the process that they go through for the nominations, so the instructions to the members were clear. And in terms of uh, the work that Rick and I did, it's a little, it takes a little more time uh, to count uh, the category using the preferential system, but it's a system, as Rick says, that we've used for years and it's well understood. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Thanks, guys. Have fun. We'll be sitting out there.